All right, before I say anything, no, this is not from Ben 10, okay? <laughs> I just want to make that very clear. Today we're talking about omnisexuality. You see, see what I did there? Yeah. Now what is omnisexuality, you may ask? Well, I'm glad you asked. You probably didn't ask, but, but I'm still going to tell you. I can guarantee that there's going to be people come, coming on this video specifically to leave hate comments, because that's been happening quite a lot. But you know what? I just got a little thing for you. All right, let's move on. <laughs> Okay, so what what is it's someone it's when someone is attracted to all gender identities. So they're attracted to transgender people, they're attracted to non binary people, they're attracted to bi gender people, they're attracted to demi boys and demi girls and demi genders and you get the picture. I've talked about all of this already, so <laughs> yeah. But yeah, that's basically what it is, because omni means all. I was gonna save that point for later, but I'll just mention it here now because it's not really worth its own point really. Yeah, omni means all. So I and yeah, that I'll get into that. Yeah, I feel like this one's kind of obvious. Uh, they they still have types, so like, even though they're attracted to all gender identities, like they still probably have like things they're attracted to on a person. Like, just say that just say an omnisexual is attracted to muscles. <laughs> like, so they'll date they'll only date people with muscles. That's what I mean. That's the best example I could think of. Or they might be attracted to broader people with brown hair and tall. And I'm just describing my dream person now. <laughs> but yeah, that is what that is. I think that makes sense. And I feel like I need to clear this up too. It's not the same as pansexual, bisexual, or polysexual. If you're wondering what all those are, I have made individual videos about all of them that you can go see. Um, I don't usually remember to put the card thing up there, but if I do, then I'll do that. Excuse me. But yeah, omnisexual is not the same thing, because bisexuality is when you like uh, two, m more than one gender. And then... Pansexuality is when gender doesn't matter, you're just like the person for who they are. And polysexuality is when you're like m multiple genders. But omnisexuality. So I said polygender, I meant polysexual. But omnisexuality is when you're like all genders. So yeah, they are very different. They're similar and they're kind of all like a, a square, really, like when you think about it. Like they're a spectrum of each other, but they're still different, if that makes sense. Also, it was first discovered in 1959. That was the same year that Supreme Beauty came out. I was always going to make that joke. Um, but yeah, that is actually quite cool to know. Nice to know that even back then, before, like, you know, oh, this woke agenda was, like, a thing, that, you know, sexualities and genders were still being discovered. So, you know what? Up yours, people that say that. <laughs> That's twice I flipped the camera off now. I should have two nickels somewhere. This one is pretty funny. Apparently, omnisexual people make jokes about being omnivores, because, like, obviously omni means all. Like, that was a point, but I feel like it's just better, it was better to mention it straight away instead of having it be its own point. But yeah, then omni means all. Omnivores are, like, creatures that, like, eat everything. Like, I don't, I can't really think of an example of an omnivore. I guess a pig is an omnivore, because they'll literally eat anything that's in front of them. I once saw a pig trying to eat a chain at a farm. That, that really happened, I swear. But yeah. And that's what it means, and I, so I think that's pretty funny. Like, you know, it'd be like, oh, so uh, I'm an omnivore, so I'm gonna go and devour a bunch of people. Like, <laughs> I'd be, that's quite funny. <laughs> I've never actually met an omnisexual, so if, if that is true, please let me know, because, like, that, I wish that, I hope that's true, because that, that's really funny. I also feel like I should say, they aren't just confused, because I feel like I said this in the bisexual one too, because, like, people just think that they're confused and greedy and ugh, but no. Just, like, you don't, you don't, you obviously don't know anything about anything, if you think this, like, um, but yeah, they're not just confused people, okay? They know who exactly who they are, they know exactly who they like, so leave them alone. It's not your fault that you don't get any bitch. Ooh, who said that? The last point, I also feel like I need to mention this, it's not a trend, okay? I feel like, you know, maybe I should have said this before the 1959 fact, but it's not just a trend, okay? Like, it, like, obviously, since it's been our thing since 1959, it's kind of hard for it to be a trend because, like, trends don't last that long. What do you mean this is the longest trend? Because trends only last, like, a day nowadays. <laughs> the longest trend I remember is fidget spinners, and they lasted, like, a month, maybe? I don't know. But, yeah, it's not a trend. And if it is, then it's the longest lasting trend I've ever seen. So, yeah, but j just so you all know, it's not a trend. So please don't say that it is. Okay, well that's everything I had to say about being omnisexual. I actually had quite a lot to say. Good for me. Because usually I struggle to find things to say about them, but I actually had quite a lot to say with this one, so I'm actually quite happy about that. Um, yeah. But if there are any omnisexual people watching this, please do let me know if the joke thing is true, because I really want to know that. I don't just want to, like, make an omnivore joke about you if you don't like it, so that that would be really helpful. And to all the haters that will get, I guarantee will watch this video, 
I hope that you have a sad life. I really do, because that would make me feel better. <laughs> but yeah, um, I'm, oh, I'm gonna get cancelled for saying that. I don't really care now. But yeah, um, let me know if you're omnisexual, just so I know about the joke, or don't. You don't owe me that information. And please like and subscribe, and I'm Evie, and I'll see you next time. Bye!